my stories of my Karina. So <laughs>
strive for better. If we challenge each other in the best ways, mm. right? Yeah. We care a lot, and kind of we always like, how do I make this better? Sometimes there are scenes that are like, hmm, we're like, how do I make this better? <laughs> or we'll get to the, the set and we'll be like rehearsing the scene, we're like, why isn't this working? Yeah. What's happening? And like, we'll actually try to make it work versus like, a lot of times, you know, some people it's just like, ah, I hate this scene, it is what it is. And every time we're like, no, how do we make this work? Um, but challenge, challenge is not bad, it's not bad. It's not bad. No, it's I like, feel like we're always like challenging each other in a positive way. We always yeah. like shoot for the stars. We the best. Yeah. And support each other. Yeah. Like anytime we've had like scenes where it's like you have to be there for me, I have to be there for you, we're always like I need to put it in. Also, let's say if the second so something, but I'm like, ah, ta da! I don't speak nothing anymore. I don't speak Italian, I don't speak English. <laughs> no, something that is amazing that some actors don't do, not necessarily on our show, even on other show. So, it, it, obviously, there is a white shot, and then there is one actor's coverage, and then the other's act, the other actor's coverage. Some actors, when they're not on camera, they like give you nothing. You're like, oh, oh. and you're like acting with the wall. We never do that. We're always there for each other. Sometimes. It's my coverage and she's crying, or vice versa. <laughs> so we're always there. I actually get a little pissed because I'm like, darn it, that was a better place. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, we are always there. Yeah. Right. Um, 
Abbiamo visto quest'anno che Maya non è un, un eroe solo per una delle paure, ma anche perché ha avuto il coraggio di, di, di andare avanti e di ricominciare da zero. And the question for you is, what was it like to uh, work on the evolution of your character? going from somebody who's certain of everything, that she's read her job, and she knows what she wants, to having that question then actually crumbling and then having to build something so different for a little while. So la domanda è, come è stato, come è qui, c'è una questa, a lavorare sull'evoluzione del personaggio, tra una persona molto sicura di se stessa, uno che invece era stato in tv e che deve creare una nuova, I mean, I loved it. I loved the challenge that they gave me to do that. But I also, I feel like every scene, everything you have with your characters, as tough as the scenes are, you have to relate to it in some sense. And I mean, I think I did, I've been doing this acting since I was a kid, and I definitely went through a phase myself where. I, challenged, I questioned everything and I didn't know if I wanted to do this. And so I was able to relate to that with Maya and not knowing why I wanted what I wanted. Did I want what I want for everyone else? Did everyone else want me to be successful so therefore I needed to continue to try to be a successful actress or did I want it? And I took a couple years off in my early 20s to really try to figure that out. So I could relate to Maya going through that aspect of it. Obviously I never had, not obviously, you guys don't know, I've never had a mental breakdown like Maya. I never went to that place. but. Um, But I think we all struggle with kind of our sense of identity and purpose at some point. And I think Maya lost her way. And it was really great to be able to play that and at least be able to have empathy for it and, and know that like, okay, this is something that's very understandable and very relatable, I think, to a lot of people out there. So I loved playing it, I loved going through it, um, as hard as it was. Um, Yeah, I'm trying to think of how else that. And I think I learned a lot from it. I think I also was able to step back and, you know, I, I'm very much a workaholic to a fault. And I think this season, what was nice was through the, the arc of my, I was able to really step back and be like, maybe I need to focus a little bit more on my personal life. <laughs> maybe I need to not be so like work, 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 work all the time. Um, so I learned a little bit of that from this arc as well. But I just, I think it was a beautiful art, and I'm still kind of pinching myself that they gave it to me to, to do, and, and I had a lot of fun, even though I hated being so sad. <laughs>
girare questa stagione, anche se molte molte scene sono, sono tristi, diciamo, quindi è stato divertente ma triste lo stesso tempo.